I've heard of people turning their gutters into HF antennas for ham radio gear as well as shortwave listening and I've always been curious to see how well it would work or how poorly it would work. So for this old Atlas, that's my project for today. I'm going to try to set up the gutters, get a wire through the base of the window and connect it up to the gutter outside and see if we can tune it up and how well it performs. The house is about 40 feet long and the run up from the ground to the gutter is about 18 feet, 18 to 20 feet. So we'll see how this works. And the plan is for the feed line to come out of the corner of that window, come around, tag into the gutter, that run goes up and then 40 feet that direction. The grounding rod is going to be right next to where the gutter connects there. And it'll just be a standard four foot copper grounding rod. And this is just a standard grounding rod. This was picked up at a ham fest a few weeks ago for about four dollars. I should have bought several of them. Because they do come in handy. And this will just attach, attach that way. Also make sure to get some sandpaper or a file and really clean up the sheet metal screw or use a new one. I can't zoom in, the resolution is not great on this camera, but this is pretty shiny at the base. And then also scrape up a little bit on the gutter itself. And then this will just attach to the other end of the coax. And that's the outside connections. All tucked in and around. I could paint that coax brown get that to blend in a little bit better if need be. That dangling wire is for one of the VHF antennas. It's actually a J-pole up on that PVC pole. And the next step is to see how this does inside. Okay, the bands are very quiet today. It's a humid September afternoon. As far as tuning this thing up, I'm on 20 meters right now, and I, I ID'd a minute ago. Um, so, checking the meter. We're about 1.5 to 1, maybe a little bit under, which is pretty impressive for what this is. The real test will be, of course, to chat with somebody and see what we can do. No one came back a little while ago, but again, the bands are very quiet. I'm pretty amazed, though, that that can load up, load up that well. And bands from 10 meters to 20 meters, so 10, 15, and 20, are under 2 to 1. When I get above 20 meters, when I hit up towards 40 and 80, the SWRs get much higher. So the next question, the next thing to check is the joint at the roof and see if the gutter is sheet metal screwed to the run at the roof or if it's just the vertical portion that is resonating right now. But in any event, kind of impressive that this sort of works. Again, bands are quiet, haven't talked to anybody. This is on 10 meters, and I sent out an ID a little while ago, a short while ago. Um, just checking this. So, 10 meters were under 1.5 to 1. So, there you go. Interesting project, something to be fine tuned, and it would appear to work to some extent. Thanks for watching.